Hello guys, welcome to Tech Vitals. Today we are going to see how to copy files and directories in the Linux CentOS. And to copy the files or directories, we use cp command. So let's start. We are in the Vitals directory and let's see uh, what files and directories that we have inside this Vitals. So we have one directory that is dir1 and we have uh, five files uh, namely file 1 to file 5 so to copy file in some other directory we use the command cp so uh, let's say if you want to copy file 1 into the dir1 then we type cp then the name of the file that we want to copy that is file 1 and the destination where we want to copy that file so the destination is dir1 now let's press the enter now let's get inside dir1 and there should be the file 1 that we just copied so let's uh, see the list yes we successfully copied the file 1 into dir1 now let's go back we can also copy the multiple files at once so this time let's copy file 2 and file 3 inside dir1 so type cp then the file file names file 2 and file 3 then type the destination dir1 okay now let's see inside dir1 there should be these uh, two files file 2 and file 3 ls yes we have file 2 and file 3 right now we are inside the dir1 and inside dir1 we have three files they are file 1 file 2 and file 3 now to copy file 4 and file 5 which are inside vitals either we can go one step back inside vitals and then we can copy file 4 and file 5 inside dir1 or if you want to copy these files from the dir1 so let's go back to dir1 now if you want to copy those files file 4 and file 5 which are inside vitals then you can also copy those files from the dir1 you just have to give the full path so we have to type cp then the full path of that file that is slash root slash tech slash vitals slash file 4 and same for the file 5 slash root slash tech slash vital slash file 5 and again you have to give the full path of uh, this dir1 that is slash root slash tech slash vitals slash dir1 so let's check the list yes we did copy these two files file 4 and file 5 and actually let's go to the vitals and let's create two more files file 6 and file 7 so now we have uh, two extra files that we just created file 6 and file 7 and now let's go to dir1 now if you want to copy these files file 6 and file 7 again we have to do the same thing that is cp that the full path of that file file 6 and file 7 and last time uh, to copy the file inside dir1 we type the full path of this uh, directory that is slash root slash take slash vital slash dir1 or we can replace this whole path with just a dot and dot indicates the present working directory that is uh, dir1 so we can just press dot instead of this long path so let's see if it works or not okay now let's check the list and we should have these uh, two files file 6 and file 7 inside this dir1 yes we have file 6 and file 7 now that's how you copy the files 
in the Linux CentOS and to copy the directories uh, you use the same command cp you just add one more attribute that is minus r just like we did in the rium command so let's go back to vitals and let's create two directories dir2 and dir3 so inside vitals now we have three directories dir1 dir2 and dir3 to copy dir2 inside dir1 we can type cp minus r dir2 and then the uh, location where we want to paste the file so this dir2 is the source and this dir1 is the destination let's press the enter now inside dir1 there should be dir2 yes dir2 and again we can copy this dir3 in the dir1 from dir1 just like we did with the files so to copy dir3 inside dir1 from dir1 we can type cp minus r give the full path of dir3 that is slash root slash take slash vital slash dir3 and then we can either give the full path of dir1 that is slash root slash take slash vital slash dir1 or we can just replace this path with dot let's press the enter now in the dir1 we should have dir3 yes we have dir3 so that's the use of cp command to copy the files and directories and that's gonna do it for this video i'll see you soon with the next video till then keep learning goodbye